guys, doing a little bit of a review on a multi-card reader. Um, my last one died. So I figured it was time to give a different company a shot, see if, uh, if they're any better. This is a Saprint connecting differently. I guess that's what it says. Um, it's a 3.0 super speed four slot memory card reader uh, compatible for Windows, Mac, and Linux. Um, pretty much covers everything. You just open it up and have a look at it. It shows up at your door sealed, which is nice. So no one's been in it. Comes with a ugh, this is a um, this one here is a special type of cable. You get this with uh, certain uh, external hard drives as well which are very hard to find. It's not just typically, um, it's not micro OS. Like that's micro SD, but uh, I don't know what that one is. That's some kind of power. Okay, so what do we got here? Uh, there's your SD, your, the one I'm looking for right here. See, it won't let it in that way, but it lets it in that way. So that was one of the problems I had with my other one is it would go other way and that's probably what uh, damaged it in the first place but that's pretty good it's nice and smooth it, it gets halfway in there it doesn't move around a lot so it won't bend the pins got your micro SD here because that's weird that one doesn't go upside down this one has to go upside down your SD and then your micro SD is right here all fit in there nicely. Um, yeah, let's uh, plug it in and uh, see what it looks like turned on. Okay, so that's tur that's turned on. I don't know if. Uh, that light there comes on or not it shows uh, oh it shows in the picture that that lights up which it doesn't well, that's too bad hmm interesting well there you go uh, if I have any issues with it I'll do a follow-up but uh, I'm pretty sure I won't because the only thing I didn't find was this isn't a light which they shows on their picture cool so that's kinda weird if you plug it into the wall uh, with an adapter this doesn't light up, but if you plug it in the computer, it does actually have a light in there. It's very dim, but it's there. I uh, just figured we'd do just a quick check to see how quickly it pops up on Windows 10. It didn't, uh, nothing popped up saying a new device was uh, discovered or anything, so maybe it's already there. I plugged it in, and it just works. So there you go. No problems there. Sound a little bit deadly. Even uh, Windows 10 doesn't even even uh, doesn't say it detects anything. It just works. So it's all good. Later, guys.